सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी हैव अ केस ऑफ लैमनेस इन ए हॉर्स सो दिस एनिमल इज प्रजेंटेड विद हिस्ट्री ऑफ नॉट पुटिंग वेट कम्प्लीटली ऑन दिस राइट फोर लिम एंड देर इज ए कम्प्लेन वेन एवर द एनिमल वॉक सो देर इज लैमनेस एनिमल इज नॉट पुटिंग वेट कम्प्लीटली ऑन द राइट फोर लिम इफ यू कंपेयर फ्रॉम द दिस लेफ्ट फोर लिम टू this is the right four limb so definitely we will find the there is a swelling in the coronet region so this is the hoof and hoof is also not uh, normal so if you see here the there is a little bit redness here and there is swelling and this swelling is very hard and this swelling is all around the in the periphery just above the this coronet so based on the this it seems that it could be a ichthyosis of the this pharyngeal bone so this case could be a case of the ring bone the next step we go for the radiography and then see whether the this case is a ring bone or something else but by the clinical sign it appear that this is a case of the ring bone we have taken the lateral uh, radiograph of the right fore limb so if you see the this particular radiograph so you will find that so this is the metacarpal bone these are different phalanges so this is the proximal phalanx this is the medial phalanx and this is the distal phalanx so you will find here so there is a new bone formation at the shaft of the this second and even the lower shaft of the this first phalanges and even in the interphalangeal articulation so it means uh, this is a definitely a case of the ring bone and in this ring bone so so there is a uh, true ring bone and also the false ring bone so this area it is basically the osteophysis or ichthyosis which is at the shaft so this is the uh, false ring bone and this one is the true ring bone this is the true ring bone this is also true ring bone and this is the all it is the false ring bone so this is all osteophyte formation and if you see so this is the third phalanx and this proximal it one is okay so and and this appears that the cause of ring bone although from the history the owner not able to you can say uh, tell that uh, because owner recently purchased a horse so but by radiography we could say that it could be because of the some trauma external trauma or it could be because of the fracture because here if you see the radio recent line is there but overall since there is a new bone formation so we could say that this is the traumatic in origin and this is the ring bone so as far as the treatment of uh, this ring bone is concerned so it is very very difficult to treat the ring bone because of this new bone formation and this particular disease is comes under the unsoundness but still you can say we uh, advise owner for anti inflammatory and analgesic drug for the 5 days and then the fomentation of this particular area using the magnesium sulfate in a lukewarm water after following the these two treatment protocols so definitely there will be a little bit of improvement but overall you can say this is the untreatable uh, disease this is the lateral view and if you see the same one is in the this one is the craniocaudal view or anterior posterior view so in this view you could also see again so here there is a lot of you can say osteophyte formation around the articular surface also so it means there is a very articular uh, osteophyte formation is also there. so overall this is a very uh, you can say complicated case and uh, so we advise owner for that he should not keep much hope but definitely uh, if you give the proper rest and follow the good treatment which i advise so this is about clinical sign and radiographic uh, feature of a ring bone disease in a horse so thank you very much for watching the video and if you are new to the channel so kindly subscribe the channel and if you like the video so share the video with your friends thank you very much